Yo, 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 what's happening people, it's your boy Smokes42 and before we say anything else, it's about fucking time we have finally hit 50,000 views and almost 180 subscribers on the channel in our first year of making YouTube videos and I cannot say big thanks to you guys, I can't thank you enough should I say uh, for helping support the channel and viewing all the videos all year long you lot have given me a lot of support over the past year and for that a big thumbs up now I did say I was going to do something a little bit more different this week when the anniversary did hit tonight which it is today when the video is going to get uploaded on the Thursday the 24th of March when I did actually make my YouTube channel I thought I'd upload something a little bit more different now in terms of different what I meant was Pokemon now we all fucking love Pokemon and if you were like me one of the 90s babies You would have got brought up into the era of Pokemon cards now these things were absolutely amazing now when we started off At the age of what eight or nine I started unpacking Pokemon cards now up until only only up until recently I came across my old stash of Pokemon cards and went through the whole deal now I do know I had a shitload of shiny Charizard, Charizard holo cards. Now, unfortunately, I could not find my folder with the 15 to 20 Charizard shinies that I had accumulated over my childhood, which I will show off as soon as I find it, because I'm going to go on a little fucking, um, a little searching spree and try getting a hold of that folder and try and show off them on the channel also. But yeah, for today, guys, we're going to be opening up something a little different. I thought I'd purchase these on YouTube a couple of days ago, and they worked out uh, £5 for a single packet. Now, to be honest with you guys, I thought it was an amazing amazing purchase, considering that they are roughly £3 to two fifty a packet. So I bought two and got two for free. And they, luckily for me, are all for the design packs for the Ancient Origins uh, trading card boosters now as you can see i will quickly show you guys all of the artwork that is on top of the booster packs now personally i've got no idea what half of these pokemon are because like i said i was only in tune for the first gen of pokemon cards now this one i think is a legendary pokemon by the name of groudon let's go through this i think this one is called a tyranitar or something i'm not really sure Looks kind of crazy, green octopus thing, I don't know, it doesn't seem like some kind of dragon, that's two of them. Now this is a Rayquaza, I ended up watching the movie so I've got some kind of idea what on earth this is. Now the final one is apparently meant to be a Hooper. Now this is another one of the legendary Pokemon, apparently I think, I'm not too sure. But yeah, let's get through these packs and let's see exactly what we can pull out of them rather than wasting too much time. So I'm not going to waste any time now and I'm going to be getting straight into this and start unwrapping all these Pokemon cards now. This is going to bring back so many memories because I have not done this for so many years. So let's get into this and let's see what we can pull out. Now, as you can see, with the Pokemon cards, you do get one of these online codes that you can redeem shit for the online game got no idea here's the code card guys enjoy yourself whoever plays that now i think the trick with this is taking three from the back and putting them to the front and that should hopefully sort shit out now the cards that i've managed to pull today are the energy recycler a curlier i think it is no idea it looks amazing the artwork i can tell they've made great changes and great improvements since the 90s right other than that we've got a sable eye i think it is a Persian, which is one of the old school Pokemon, I definitely recognize that, the evolved form of Meowth. A Magikarp. What the hell is one of them? Viva la Vista! <laughs> now we've got a Spinarak, which was from the second gen of Pokemon, I think it is, if you remember that. We've got a Golurk, which I've got no idea what on earth one of them is, looks like a bodyguard of Machamp. Next, we've got some kind of shiny. I think this is a reverse hollow shiny card. A La Vesta. Viva La Vesta. And finally, for our first pack, we've got a rare Regice, which doesn't look too bad. Cool, cool. We can deal with that. We can deal with that. Right, that's the first pack out of the way. Nothing too great. I'll just quickly open up these packs. And hopefully, we can get some decent pulls out of the second one because I do want to get something decent out of here. Because that's all we have really bought these packs for. Now, other than that, I didn't really 
purchase this for any other reason. I just wanted to make sure that I did get some decent enough shit out of this and hopefully it's probably the best things in the whole thing. So let's see what we can get out of this. Finally that pack has opened. Now firstly we've got a Meowth to go with the Persian from the last pack. Another Magikarp. A Ralts, I think that is, yeah, a Ralts. An Oddish. Oh, how crazy does that look? Honestly, the artwork's gone. Really amazing, I, I do like that one. Next, we've got ourselves an Eevee. Which is a cool Pokemon, changes into like seven different forms. Next, we've got a Reverse Hollow of Porygon Z. And I've got no idea what on earth one of these are. It's an EX card. I think this is somewhat crazily good. So we've managed to pull ourselves a Tyranitar EX. I think that was on the artwork cover. So I'll quickly just show you guys that. Yep, managed to pull ourselves one of them, one of them beasts. So yeah, we've got ourselves somewhat decent from the off. I'll put that just aside quickly. Next, we've got ourselves another Sableye. Alessander. And finally, a Vespi Queen. And the code card, guys, is on screen for you guys to take away. So enjoy that. Right, next one. Next pack opening. Let's see what we can do with this one. I'll quickly just open this up. Hopefully, we can get another one of them PX cards. That was a nice little shiny card that I saw. I've got no idea what any of these cards are. So, yeah, firstly, here's the code card for you guys to enjoy. Just put that aside and I'll quickly take three from the back, put them to the front. And right here, we've got the next pack opening, which is the third pack in. We've got a level ball, a curlier, faded town, a gullet, a combi. What the hell is one of them? <laughs> a malama, which looks like some next of a squid out of the water. Cool. Altoy, I can remember one of them somewhere in the anime when I watched it as a young kid. We've got an unknown, guys. I can remember this from the movie where the Entei was in the movie. Absolutely loved that as a child. Next, we've got a reverse Aridos, which is another shiny card. And finally, for our rare in the pack, we've got ourselves a Garidos. So not too much of a bad pack. So far, only one EX card. Now, finally, we've got Groudon, which is probably my most favorite Pokemon out of all of these, so let's open this pack and let's see what we can get. Hopefully, we get another EX card because that's all we really wanted out of this whole experience of opening Pokemon cards. So let's see what happens now, guys. Right, I'll move three from the back. Just move the code card aside for you guys, and hopefully, we can pull ourselves something decent out of this final pack. Right, the code card is there, guys. Enjoy that. I'll put that aside. Now we've got ourselves a Vaporeon, a Porygon 2, a Paint Roller, a Paint Roller, Jesus. I could do with them, and I'm meant to be doing a paint around the house, anyways. Right, a Spinner Up, we've got another Meowth, a Quagsire, a Combi, which seems like some kind of flying. Honeycomb, I don't even know what on earth that is anyways. We've got a Malama and we've got a reverse gloom and finally another EX card guys which is a Garrett Giratina or whatever on earth you want to call it. So we did manage to get ourselves some decent pulls out of that. Them four packs overall got ourselves two EX cards which I think are the new shiny rare cards that you can get out of these packs nowadays. As I, as I said, I've got no idea so yeah. We managed to pull ourselves a Tyranitar EX and a Giratina EX. Now, yeah guys, that's the end of the video. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like, click that sub button. And yeah, if you'd like to see more Pokemon videos, uh, uh, make sure you comment below and I'll try to do more in the future. But anyways guys, if you have enjoyed that, like I said, hit that like, click that sub. Catch you next time. Peace out.